along a mile stretch in El Paso, Texas, that divides the U.S. and Mexico, Oklahomans are keeping close watch. We walk up and down, we will patrol a little bit, and we just call up if anything suspicious looks, looks like it's going on, if anybody looks like they're about to cross, we'll call that up, get some help down here. When it's real hot out like this, they're, they're pretty, they, they usually stay back in the shade up underneath bridges and stuff and won't really try and cross. Every now and then you'll have some that'll come up and try and get through. I have seen families uh, try to cross and, you know, with young kids, babies, and it is, um, you know, as a human being, it is a little bit tougher to see that um, because nobody would stand out you know, over 100 degree weather, you know, all day, you know, if they weren't in need of something. As a human being, I feel for those people and it is a difficult, uh, you know, time to, you know, to tell them that they need to go and, you know, try to cross the right way. 